covering the Shenandoah Valley and the DMV for over 12 years. Shenandoah Teleproductions. From Clark County Sports and ClarkCountySports.com. We're here at the Felt. Wilbraham Felker Stadium in Berryville, Virginia. For tonight's first round, BHSL AA East Conference Championship Playoff. The first round of 16 teams. Clark uh, seated number four. They'll play host to number 13, Frank Nandua, who came up from the Eastern Shore. Quite a drive. They elected to play tonight instead of tomorrow. Uh, they come in with a 7-3 record. Your Eagles are 10-0 uh, after finishing last uh, regular season 10-0 uh, before falling in the playoffs. So they're on mission. And uh, also weather may come into play as it's about 34 degrees right now. A little bit of a breeze. Uh, sure, neither one of these teams has played much this year in the cold weather. So we'll see how that plays out. We're here for all your playoff coverage. We'll have highlights, interviews, and more on the ClarkCountySports.com Game of the Week. Salute to service to our veterans from ClarkCountySports.com.
for the second quarter. It's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. The Eagles lead 35 to nothing at the half. Uh, the game started out close. Both teams held each other on the first couple drives. Clark has broken things open. Uh, Hunter has a long run. Sean has a couple. Uh, touchdown to Matt Bang. It's all Eagles, 35 to nothing at the half. You're watching the game of the week on ClarkCountySports.com. <laughs> Sick today. Uh, your, your thought, what did you guys say, say about uh, that? Well, it was very sad. Uh, we prayed for him and hope he gets better. And um, we got this victory for him tonight. And it's too early to tell who you got, but you will be here next year. 
Uh, yeah, yes, sir. Yeah. Okay, well, you heard that from Hunter Rogers after the 44 to nothing win. It's Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. Thanks, Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. We'll hear from Julius Graham after the Eagles' big win. Uh, you had a couple big plays, and you were looking good on both sides of the ball. Can you just talk a little bit about the game? Yeah, we started out slow, but I mean, after the first two drives, we kicked it in, stepped our defense up, and ran the ball like we were supposed to. Uh, they had a pretty pretty athletic quarterback, but you guys had him on the run all night. Uh, did you think he'd be that easy to get to? No, not at first, but we realized once we kept hitting him hard like we were doing that he'd fall eventually, and sure enough, he did. And uh, how you feel about uh, talking to Hunter about the coach went down sick today? I guess you guys might have dedicated this to him. Yeah, it was sad, but we knew we had to overcome it, play it anyway, play it like we did, and finish off talk. Okay, we'll be back here next week, and we're not sure who we're playing yet, but this is Mo Murphy with Julius Grant and Wilbur Felton. Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. We're here with Eagles quarterback Sean McDonald after the big win. Sean started out a little tight there. They they played you tough the first couple series, but I think you guys just won down. Yeah, you uh, we know we've been working hard all offseason to get bigger, faster, and stronger. I think that shows throughout the rest of the game. Uh, a little controversy is never bad in the first part of the game, but uh, the way we have to come at least six on the And uh, mix it up again good with the pass and the run. Uh, was there any different? Plans with Coach Parker out in case he pretty much called the same game. Uh, yeah, for the most part, you know, coaches are pretty universal. They all know the offense, they all know the defense. So I had full confidence in Coach Alex calling the play. Uh, it's always hard when you have adversity and missing the head coach, but I think we all did a good job of stepping up. And at least one more game at home. So how do you feel about next week? Oh, I'm confident. You know, whoever we're going to play is going to be pretty good, but uh, you know, we played good teams in the past, so we're ready. Okay, we well, heard that from Sean McDonald after the 44 to nothing win over Nandu. This is Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. Good luck, Nick. This is Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. We're here with the Eagles assistant coach. Tonight he was the head coach, Casey Childs. Casey, big 44 to nothing win over Nandu. Can you just talk a little bit about the team's performance? You know, I thought the kids did a great job. Uh, early on, we, we hurt ourselves a little bit with the costly penalty on one long run. Uh, they were doing some different stunts up front that we were able to, by the time the third series came around, we were able to make some adjustments and our kids picked up, uh, you know, picked up what was going on. And at that point, we were able to take control of the game and get back to what we do best. And uh, what do you know about Coach Parker? We just know he went down sick today. Or yeah, he was extremely ill pretty much all day. And by the end of the school day, uh, he, he was pretty bad. Uh, not. Yeah, he'll be fine. Right. But uh, he was to the point where he didn't need to be out here in this kind of weather, the way that he felt and everything else. So the kids, we talked about it at a team meal, uh, that what we all need to do to come together and, and take on different roles. And I and, uh, couldn't be more proud of the coaching staff and, and the kids tonight for the way they adapted and overcame everything this evening. And we don't know yet who you're going to play, but I understand it will be here. Yeah, it'll be here. It'll be either Nottaway or Amelia. I haven't really got an uh, update on who won that game. I know Nottaway was winning early. The winner but other Nottaway than that, Amelia that's correct. Okay, well, you heard that from Coach Casey Childs after the Eagles' first playoff victory of the 2014 season. This is Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports at the Felt. Thanks, Mo. Appreciate it. Thanks. Thank you, buddy. This is Mo Murphy from Clark County Sports. We're here at Wilbur M. Feltner Stadium in Berryville, Virginia, the Felt, for the special Friday Night Lights Playoffs edition. Playoffs? You kidding me? No, we're not kidding. We're in the playoffs. <laughs>